Hello and welcome to the Switch Underground. My name is Danny and today we are starting a new game called Pinstripe by Atmos Games by Thomas Brush. This game was created over a period of I think about five years by a single guy by Thomas and he wrote all of the music and did all the art and programming. So if you're a fan of the one-man bands as it were like uh, Axiom Verge then this is the game for you. That's pretty loud. This game was initially released in April of 2017 on the PC, and I actually played that one for a little bit. Let's take a look at our options here. Nothing that we want to change. Cool. Uh, it's currently on the Nintendo eShop for $14.99. I think it came out last week, or maybe two weeks ago. I had it preloaded for a little bit, so. Thomas Brush Presents. This is a platformer about a priest, I believe, whose daughter gets kidnapped by the villain Pinstripe, and we have to go travel down to hell to rescue her. A game for Kelsey. Very peaceful. Weeping may stay for the night, but rejoicing comes in the morning. I'm a big fan of a new day changing everything. Loading the pee. I hear a train. Wake up, Daddy. You're sleepwalking again. Whoops. Hey, do you smell smoke? Maybe. Let's go investigate. Okay, Bo. You can be Sherlock. You're silly. That must be my daughter. It's a mirror, Sherlock. It's so dusty, I can barely see your face. Spoo. Ooh. Thanks, Watson. You're cute. <laughs> look at us, Dad. We look like funny ghosts. Kind of. Oh, right. <laughs> Boom. Oh. Okay, ZL. Let's us look at something that we have. Oh, these must be the unlockables. Okay, what are our abilities here? See a thing up there. Let's grab it. What's that, Daddy? It's a drop. It looks like a frozen drop of oil. Oil. Let's go look at the doggies. Poor Georgie. Oh. Georgie must be our dog. He's all stuffed in his crate. Poor Georgie. Ooh, was this a button? We well, pushed it. Oh, well, that was to open the door. If we push L, can we look at the drop? I don't think the drop was the item here. All right, let's keep it moving. Why is all your stuff thrown out that door, Daddy? Well, that's not good. Be our wife. Looks like it's got something in the back here that we can mess with later. What was that? A strange portrait of a man. Buddy Debly. Bly Blick. Saving the game. Game is saved. Let's keep moving. Okay. Sherlock, I think I can reach that button. <laughs> okay, you stay there, Bo. I'm gonna hit this. Sherlock, I think I can reach that button. 
button. Okay. Got it. Good job, big girl. This is a pleasant train ride. Although I know it's gonna go bad immediately. <gasps> Door closed. Oh, but how did this get here? Oh, it's Bo's notebook. Don't look at it, Daddy. It's just a silly drawing. What do you mean? Oh. Failure. That's us, Georgie, and Mommy as an angel. Oh, oh God, I'm feeling some tears. Okay. There are ourselves a little bit of a puzzle here. Okay, so what are you locked in? Oh, I see. We gotta push the buttons. You look like a jumping bean, sir. Jump, jump, jumping bean. <laughs> Not mean. He's so lean. Well, does he give jumping, me a jumpy whoop whoop whoop? I'm He's doing the best here. With a toot, toot, toot. Oh, that sounds like something really a little kid like would that say. Show. I wonder if that's a British show or something. I've never heard of that. Such a silly show. I didn't know you liked that show, Sherlock. Bo, I, I like everything you, you like. Do your smoke and investigate homicide. Well, never underestimate Sherlock. Oh man, do I have to be quick or what? Okay. Oh, that, now all three are up. One. Oh no. Okay. Hey, get back up there. Okay. Got it. Ooh. This must be pinstripe. Good morning, Ted. Good morning. And who might this be? This is Bo. Hello there, Bo. He's a creep. How about a shiny black one? We don't need your balloons. I like your dress. We're gonna be polite. Rose. Ew. Looks like a giant old sack. Yeah, it does. It makes me dizzy. Oh no, we've been poisoned. I think you should stop. It looks like it's bad for you. Look! A balloon, Daddy! No, oh, come back. Come back. Don't follow that thing. Where'd you go? Oh, no. Oh. Georgie, stay put. Hey, give me back my daughter, you creep. Yes. But don't worry, Ted. She'll soon call me father. I don't think so, bud. Hit him in the face. Let's go. Who did? Oh, that son of a bee. Well, that's unnerving. It's right in the feels, man. Oh, so cute. We have to get her back. We're gonna need Georgie's help. How you guys doing today? Bit of a somber start, I know. Hopefully your day is going better than Bo's. And me. I guess I'm Ted. Well, that music came nice again. So my daughter's gone, my wife is dead. 
And here we are in Edgewood. I guess we need to collect those things. Bow's scarf. Smells like smoke. And whiskey. That's not good. Which way should we go? Eh, let's go this way. Ah! Crap. Okay. We're gonna need something to take care of that. Composition. The consumption of my speed shrooms is strictly prohibited. Side effects include nausea, diarrhea, suicidal thoughts. Wow. Or a plus one upgrade of a player's SS shoot speed. So don't do it. Prince. Princel's Balloon Shop. Uh. Eat it. Okay. So there's that up there. Something's up there. Let's keep going. Can we open that? Nope. Oh. Okay, we went too far. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. We made it. And we have a bunch of these oil drop things that do something. Just keep going this way till we can't go anymore. Who's in there? Oh. An old naked dude. Oh my god, it's Outlast again. A portrait of another, a very aggressive looking male, Gronk. Saving. Save. Uh, Mr. Mr. Dicky. Don't you recognize this sexy face, swine? It's me, Mr. Dicky. Okay, Mr. Dicky. Just get out of here. I'm miserable. Welcome to hell. <laughs> now get pins right. I, I, I think I might know where she is, Ted. Where is she? The Hangley House. The Hangley House? But I'm not sure how you're going to defend that silly body of yours without you. a weapon. Until you find one, I, I'm afraid I can't help you. We need a weapon? <gasps> Ooh, there's a weapon up there. A slingshot. Okay. Need you what? Okay, so we have a creepy tree that's hungry, uh, an old guy that smells, and that's not going to open anytime soon, okay. So let's see what we're missing here. Do I want to jump down there? Is there anything down here? No. Just a whole bunch of Winnie the Pooh's honey pots. What's that? Hey. Hello, Felix. Up here. Yeah, I see you. Why do you dress like a preacher? Well, here's the thing. I had a calling, Felix. Have you tried these sack things? No. I don't think well, I should. Alright, buddy. Uh oh. Where'd you go, Felix? Uh oh. Wake up, brother. Oh, let's try the sack first. One of those sacks. With a sensational scent. Took it. the sack? Hold on. 
Elix, thank you, thank you for your service. Okay, let's go feed this to the creepy tree and see if it's what it wants. Let's go in there. Yes, yes, yes. Yo, old tree, I brought you a sack. Yummy, huh? Oh, okay. I see. That's how we're gonna do this? Bo's toy slingshot. Happy birthday, Bo is carved into the wood. Press ZR to release. You can break things like that box. Oh, okay. Nailed it. Oh, I don't know the combination. Okay, we can break a box. Can I break a lamp? Sensitivities. Yes, I can. Can I break a honey pot? I can. Good. Now we can bust crap open. <gasps> of course, now that turd is gone. That sucks. Okay, we got her. Oh wait, we want to bust that. What oh. took you so long, bat slug? I'll meet you up at the Hangley House. Uh. Sensitivity is pretty, pretty high. I, I'm pretty sure we can't shoot that. Okay. Uh, what did I want to break in here? A honey pot. I got a speed room. Are we moving faster? Okay. A Hangley House. Oh yeah, there was that crate over there we could break. Actually, crate up there too. Uh, never mind. It's not a crate at all. All right. This this door is locked with a golden padlock. Geez, I wonder what could open it. Ooh, how do I get up there? I see some tracks. Georgie must be here. Right? Ooh, what's that? A secret film strip? How do I open that? Didn't I have an inventory? Where did it go? There it is. Got a secret film strip, but no way to play it. Yeah, ZL. There it is. Okay, let's go back. All right. Oh wait, there's a thing up there. How do I get up to the train? Maybe if I take this really high. Now uh, let's just continue. Break what we can, we'll come back for all that stuff. Oh, 
Here we are. Never mind. That didn't do anything. Okay, some birds. Okay, now we can use bow slingshot. Get some more of that. Oh. That worked. I wish I knew how to play that film. I can't remember if there was like something special we had to do. We'll see. Pinstripe. Hangley House. Dicky became surprisingly mobile. It's a good thing we're being nice to everybody. Wouldn't want to be an asshole. What's that thing? A Hangley Pass. Oh, can't break that. What's this? Mr. P's house. Can't see anything else. Just that that is probably where Bo is. <laughs> Turd. This guy's voice, dude. Stinking mothball dicky to help you find. Absolutely, we did. Pinstripe. My intuition tells me that poor old Dicky's back is as strong as a silly wooden puppet. I hate this guy. So I think Bo will just spend some time with me in my little. I don't think so. Yes. I think that's precisely what we'll do. Bro. You freakishly stupid looking idiot. We're gonna play it cool. We're gonna play it like an argument with a loved one. The less you say, the more angry they get. Up is the Hangley Pass. Down is the red wash. Let's take the red wash. We're gonna have to go there anyway. This cave looks dark and evil. It's pitch black and nothing can be seen. Well, I guess that means we're not going in. This thing is beeping though. I don't know why we need to collect all these mushrooms. But we're going to. Okay, so that one's beeping. Because it probably has, what, no power? <gasps> oh, okay. So that's the yellow one and the green one. And where's the red one? We're going to free you, Georgie. As soon as we find what we're looking for here. Turn that thing. Okay. There it is. Dicky. Bro. Let's talk. Uh, uh, oh, my back feels like hell. Now listen, snot. We don't have much time. Uh, Bo is just up the mountain in the Hangley house. I'd love to see those prissy pin legs climb this mountain at my age. Oh, well. You've done enough, brother. I'm running around like a buffoon. When I was your age, I was working 80 hours a week at my father's steel mill. That is a lot of hours. He would uh, beat me with a broken steam pipe on a daily basis. That's good parenting. I, I still have the scars. Not supposed to leave Mark, though. Bad parenting. Sorry, Dicky. All right, let's go get, let's go free the dog. Let's 
coming for you, buddy. Thanks for that, Ted. I was wondering if I was ever gonna get out of that thing. George hey, can speak. Where's Bo? Uh, I was afraid of that. Well, we've got to get her, man. Yes, we do. I wonder do. if I can help sniff out some clues or something. I think you Speaking can. Of which, is Mr. Dickey somewhere around here? He is. Yeah, I can smell that guy's butt from a mile away. That pinstripe guy. He's such a jerk. Come on, buddy. I saw a clue over here. Let's go get it. Right here. Sniff it out, bro. What you got in there? Just let me touch the key. I don't think touching the key is going to do anything. Nope. Alright. Come on, Georgie. Let's go talk to Dickie. Or don't. It's fine. I know where another clue is. Okay, so it looks like we need to cup the power. Father? Father? Yes. Help! Help! This demon thing is eating me alive! Is that Jack from Jack's Skeptic Eye? I'm not eating you. I'm just delivering you to Rebus. Don't worry, sweetie. It's plenty of fun down there. This is sack juice to drink all day and night. Oh, really? Ew. <clears throat> well then. Hurry up. We haven't got all day. That is definitely Jack Skeptic Eye guy. There's no way it's not. That's funny. Ooh, a puzzle. That's right. Ooh, take us up a clue, bro. An old Bible. We're gonna need that. Red Wash Baptist. Father, we're so sorry for your loss. 2 Samuel 9 8, elders and staff. Okay. Can I bust this open? I cannot. Well, I'd like to have a save point here. It says brute. Door is locked with a golden padlock. Another golden padlock. The door is locked with a silver padlock. Okay, let's it's one of you guys. Get out of my face. Okay. So we need. What do we need? We need a silver key, we need a couple golden keys. Need to jump off this ledge. We died. Okay, there's one more clue for the doggo, and I remember it's back here. Oh. I see. We can actually get on top of that. But let's go back and save. Our episode is getting to a half hour. We gotta take a break. Nothing there. Turd. This game is beautiful, man. I'd forgotten. Like, the ambiance, the music, the story, the characters. I'm like 99% sure that was the Jack Skeptic Eye guy. I think that's his name. He always starts his videos with like, Top of the morning to you! One of you guys. Get out of my face. Alright. Let's not get burned. Oh, another one. Yeah. 
gotta be careful. I only get like, oh, there it is. Oh god. Oops. An empty pill bottle. What does it say? Stage four treatment. Somebody's. Oh. That must be Dickies, right? All right, let's go save our game. And we know our next step is to is to go to that um, the big log that's falling down and actually land on top of it and use the thing to the other side to do it. So that is the beginning of Pinstripe by Thomas Brush of Atmos Games. I'm assuming he made the company. Uh, really cool game, art style. Took a while to make. And there's the, the, what does it say on the wall here? Birdie. So there's birdie, we've seen the word brute, and some other things carved around. It'll be interesting to see how that plays. I don't know what the oil things are for yet. We're down a heart. We have a film that we can't see. But uh, this is really neat, and I'm excited to continue playing it. If you enjoyed your time here, give us a thumbs up. You can subscribe to the channel if you want to continue following the series. We're also playing Flipping Death by Zoink Games. Very fun title. And that's going to do it for me. Good to each other. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.